Today, I want to talk about uh, and explain all-in-one apps. So there are all-in-one messaging apps. There's two that I'm very familiar with uh, for the PC, for Windows, and there should be some for other operating systems. I know Rambox is there for Linux. Um, I do not know if Rambox exists for uh, Mac. Um, yeah, there it is. It, it does. So there you go. Rambox will be all three. So these are ways to put all of your messaging apps into one app. That way you don't have to open each one whenever you get a message. So for example, I have my calendar, my mail, my messenger, Discord, Google Voice, Evernote, and GroupMe. I have all of these and you can put an unlimited amount and you can add different services services or apps for example you could get your text messages inside Rambox um, I don't have phone service right now so I don't have that but you can connect the two um, and at the same time uh, you could do Skype, Steam, uh, different ones, WhatsApp and you can have them all in here Twitter, Facebook, you can add custom websites like Meetup. Meetup works and you actually get the notification whenever somebody messages you. Uh, you could do LinkedIn, um, a bunch of different ones, probably most of the ones that you could think of except Instagram. Instagram, uh, you can only get direct messages. You can't get the actual feed and post and all that. Uh, so whenever you get a message, it aggregates together into Rambox and shows you a notification. I'll give you an example. So let me send myself a uh, email. There we go. Alright, so you see that one there and if you were to, well usually, let me see, maybe if I do out of it, minimize. Usually there's a little number right here in the start menu and it tells you how many you got. Huh. Well, it's not doing it right now for some reason, but usually it works. At the same time, you could see all of your messages. So if I were to send myself a message, let's see, Jesse Guerrero. There you go. I send myself a message. Whoops. Okay, did I get it? No. But if you get a message and you don't click on it there will be a little one right here same thing with discord you get a little one for every single mention and every single direct message every single text from google voice any type of notification from evernote such as someone's trying to log into it uh, different ones for group me as well and notifications for google voice uh, pretty much all of these and usually i don't know what i did different but it shows you the number when you minimize it at the bottom on the taskbar. The same thing happens with Franz. Franz is the same type of thing uh, where you aggregate the messages. Rambox is an open source community type of aggregate all-in-one service while Franz is more of a premium higher quality pay for it type of thing. Um, it is better Franz in my opinion. I tried it with just three apps and it was great but because Rambox is free and I get unlimited apps that's why I do this one and Pro has the ability to monitor and track how much activity you're doing and a bunch of other uh, different fun things uh, such as uh, more apps and support what else themes um, mobile view wow that sounds really cool uh, there are a lot of things that you could do and it's just awesome. Uh, so I highly recommend Franz and Rambox, either one. Uh, just remember that uh, Franz is more for premium and there there's a lot of time saved doing this, a lot of headaches. I don't have to go to each one of these um, individually and uh, all I have to do to do anything is just click right here look at all my notifications if it's all zero minimize that's it 
bring it up. It, there's a, it's a hectic day. There's five here, two there, three there. I'm gonna have to go to each individual one and check everything. And I don't get notifications right over here like you normally do in these notification things. Instead, all I do is I put everything through Rambox. And remember, you can do the same thing with Franz. It's good for Linux, Mac OS. And it's generally speaking in the productivity niche uh, where you are trying to uh, save time and get more efficiency in your computing and your computer use. Generally speaking, these are real popular in that niche. So it's not something new or novel or uh, hypothetical. This is, a, this is a real productivity tool. All right, I hope you learned something.